I am pretty sure while playing ML, you must have encountered yourself in a scenario where you were inside your turret and got slain by the enemy easily or while you were recalling in low HP, which is pretty annoying. And it must have made you think about how I can do that too. Hi guys, Kazuki here and in this video, we are going to discuss about heroes with which we can turret dive easily and effectively. So without any further ado, let's roll into our video. Johnson can be very effective in turret dive as he can easily chase enemies and knock them out. Though it can be hard to drive but once mastered, it's pretty easy to turret dive with this hero. Argus can deal massive damage while being immune to turret damage as his ultimate makes him immortal for a few seconds which can be very beneficial for turret diving but make sure to use your ultimate at the right time Natalia is a nightmare for squishy heroes even inside their turret Her stealth mode and enhanced damage from passive is what makes her a good hero to do turret dive. Sun can be played as an offlaner in the experience lane or as a jungler too. He with his doppelganger can be very good for turret diving as he can remain immune while marking the enemy as his doppelgangers will be taking damage from the turret. Selena is probably the hero which can give pain in your opponent's ass. As not only she can stun enemy but can also deal huge damage and can escape easily with her second skill. Turret diving is literally easy for Lancelot as not only he can trigger multiple dashes, he can even immune turret damage with his second skill making him an effective turret diver. As Link can easily walk and jump over walls, it makes him suitable for turret dive too. He can easily dive and secure kill without being killed. As in his ultimate, he becomes invincible to all kinds of damages including turret damages for a few seconds. Do remember for effective turret dive, blue buff is important for him. Hayabusa can pretty easily do turret dive. He can enter inside the turret using the second skill and then followed by the first skill and ultimate. While attacking an opponent inside turret using ultimate, he is immune to all kinds of CC skills or damages as in his ultimate, he turns into a shadow. Fanny can be the best choice for turret diving as she can easily dive in using her cables and mark multiple heroes in one go. She is buff dependent for aggressive turret diving and she is quite hard to master. Hanjo will be the best hero to turret dive as he leaves his body and turns into a soul after his ultimate is casted, which gives him a great advantage for turret dive. Do keep a look at your body as the enemy might mark your main body. Harley with his poking abilities is really good for turret diving. He can easily dive in with his second skill then use the ultimate and first skill on the enemy. After that use second skill to come outside the turret but don't turret dive against stun heroes.
Turret dive is easy peasy with Yen because of his most unique ultimate where he can take the enemy in his domain. This not only gives him immunity from what's going on the battlefield but also he is free from turret damage as it can't mark him in his domain. Chu with his dash skills and ultimate can easily dive in and kick the enemy outside his turret which is what we expect in turret diving. But make sure you kick on the right side. Gushen can easily dive in, burst enemy and come out safe with his different combos. Just remember to use your skills wisely. Kadita can be effective in turret diving. As she can dive in with her first skill followed by ultimate. During her ultimate, she is immune to every skill and damage. And her movement speed is increased which is beneficial for coming out of turret range. So that will be all for this video and if you want to see more videos like this do comment down below. Thank you guys for watching keep supporting Kazuki official. Time for amazing cleanup.